My name is Jonah. I'm an eighth grader at Hastings Middle School. Oh, yeah! And this poem is titled, The Day You Threatened Death. January 30th, 2019. This was the day you did it. You typed in a group chat full of anxiety ridden people a message that would change my life forever. I have a noose. I'm going to kill myself. Along with a picture of said noose you had tied sent at 6.57 p.m. on a Wednesday night. I knew you didn't just pull the picture from Google because of the hand that was holding the wretched knot. Your hand. The swirly copper colored ring on your slim pale fingers that I could see in every that I could see every vein in was a clear indication that it was you. Your skin is similar to that of a jellyfish, almost translucent. I, it scared me to think that you might get even paler soon. The Discord call was frantic. I wish you could have heard me. Maybe you'd feel worse than you already do. I started shaking and laughing uncontrollably, tears falling from my cheeks. I was terrified. My heart was beating so fast, my hands went numb and sweaty. Calm down, Jonah, is all I heard from the two present witness to witness my mental downfall. How can I calm down when you just said that? I st laughing stopped, my stomach started to churn. I felt as if I'd be sick at any moment. As I clung to my soft, minty blanket, the feeling only got worse. But what if he hurts himself? Only thought on my mind was you. I can't imagine my life without you in it. You're so sweet and kind to everyone. You've always been there for me, and I couldn't do the same for you. Maybe you were already gone. Maybe we're too late. That moment, I couldn't help but cherish the time I'd have with you. I barely noticed the time going by when I heard Jonah. He's okay. In silence. 7.57 p.m., January 30th, 2019, on a Wednesday night, exactly one hour after you sent that message, I got the news that you weren't dead. One hour of pure torture and agony just to know it was all an act. I quietly got up, still shaking, and got a snack.